mm -hmm. for us girl to group bees. You know, yeah, you know, we, we, we appreciate you guys <laughs> and girls. <laughs> <a lot> girls. <laughs> <laughs> and um, tell us a little bit about um, the different types of uh, drumming styles. Or you, you, um, you mentioned that most people learn rock drumming. Can you demonstrate something what shows us what rock drumming is versus maybe swing drumming? Sure. When most people want to learn the drums, a lot of times they're referring to rock or pop drumming, which consists mostly of eighth note beats. So you'll hear in so many songs where it's like, okay, that straight ahead hitting is eighth notes. I notice you're hitting on the rim. Is that normally what you do? This is my simulated mini drum set. Okay. <laughs> okay. So this is like my hi hat, or where I put my riding hand. And this is my simulated snare drum, or this one here. Sometimes I put that up here. Oh, okay, so a lot of people, when they want to learn the drums, they're talking about rock or pop, so that's straight ahead, a lot of eighth notes. Mm -hmm. And then they vary the foot, and they vary the hand. Sometimes they might have 16 notes. Okay, so rock and pop, and that consists usually of four, four time, where the count goes up to four. Okay, so once they learn beats and fills in eighth notes and sixteenth notes at all different tempos, they're ready to play probably, th I'd say, thousands of songs. Oh, that's interesting. That's interesting. Can you demonstrate uh, the rock versus the jazz kind of beat? Sure. With the rock and pop, notice I was doing the straight eighth notes or sixteenths. Okay. We can do that at all different tempos. When it comes to things like genres like blues and jazz, we're talking more about triplets and swing feel. Okay, so triplets gets divided up to three subdivisions in one beat. One triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four triplet, one. That's gonna have a more round sound than eighth notes and sixteenths. Here's eighth notes. One and two and three and four and. Okay, triplets will be one triplet, two triplet, three triplet, four triplet, one. And then we can, if we take out that middle triplet, that second partial, it will be swing. Okay. Or shuffle. Uh -huh. Notice that is a rounder feel. So I'm going to do the straight ahead feel of eights and sixteenths. Then I'm going to do the shuffle and triplets. Okay, here's mm -hmm. straight ahead, eights and sixteenths. One and two and three and four and one E and the two E and the three E and the four E and a one. Now, the swing feel. See the difference? One's da 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 mm -hmm. da da, one's da da da. 